Hey y'all, welcome to my channel and today I'd like to share something that I've recently just learned, very very recently actually. So a few weeks ago I sent a Twitter post asking people to ask um, for suggestions on gameplay and combo for Peacock because it's a character that I've never really played before and I've only leveled her for like the defense, that's all folks and um, untouchable. But I got a great offensive set so I thought learn how to use it. So let me just show you the moves that I decided to use. And this video is basically me um, showing you what I learned, basically. And it's really simple and effective because I'm a pretty practical guy. I like to do things with the bare minimum of effort, but with the high highest effectiveness. Now I'm just like rambling. But anyway, um, this is the move set that I choose. Now, Impending Doom, George Day Out, and Boxcar George, these three moves I feel like are very, very important. They're very easy to use and they're really, really important for combo extenders and just pure damage. Now, these two are a little bit variable. You can put a um, unblockable, unblockable blockbuster, you can put bang, 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 you can put Argus Argony, Agony for to activate signature abilities that uses projectiles, which is a lot in Peacock because it's one of her main features. So it really depends on what you want, but I quite like. Uh, George at the air show and bandwagon rushdown because they they hit um, they hit for a low number of hits and they deal a lot of damage. I again I'm a practical guy I like to do a lot of damage in the least amount of effort possible. And I think this set is quite good for rift as well because in rift usually against defensive catalyst there's like abilities that activates giving them buffs depending on when they're hit, so having a lower number of hits means you're activating that those abilities less often. But anyway, yeah, these two are very, you can change it to suit your needs, immunity, outtake, anything. But I like to focus on these three, and I think they're very important. So just so, a few pointers, like when you start the game, what I usually do is do a combo, normal combo, launch them, and immediately use the Boxer, George, and George Day Out. Like, simple as that, just use those two in combination and could deal a lot of damage already. That's the first part, okay? That's the easy part. Like, that's, like, that's the first thing that I learned in like two seconds f from reading people's responses. Now, this one is gonna be a bit more tricky. And so, this is a beginner's video, but it's not really beginner's because Pe Peacock is this, one of those fighters where she can get very, very technical and there's a lot of ways you can do her combos. It's actually really insane. Okay, let's repeat that again. So, the combo is simple. You do your normal juggle, then you use Impending Doom, and attack the opponent while the impending do uh, hitting them. You do one, two, and then you do air dash, I mean air launch, and then dash, and then continue with your normal combo, okay? So let me um, show you again. So when, the moment you start uh, using impending doom, you tap twice, air launch, and dash attack. That's all. Now let's see this in action, okay? One, two, three, four, five. One, two. Did you see what happened? The opponent stays on the ground. Now, if I just do, if I just do a normal combo while well, impending doom is, um, like that happens, the opponent gets bounced off. So, having the opponent stay on the ground so you can extend your combos mm -hmm. is very, very important, and it's one of the few things that I learned. So again, recap. On the second tap, you air launch and then you dash attack. The timing has to be right. This is really difficult. So let's try that again. One, two, three, four, five. One, two. And then you can combo with the first thing that we learned and to deal that much damage. Now, unfortunately, this doesn't work against all characters. It works against most heavy characters like Cerebella, Big Ben, um, yeah, and all those stuff. But it doesn't work against Peacock, Valentine, and I think Philia, and like those lightweight um, characters. So for lightweight characters... Alright, for lightweights, it's a bit more complicated. I've tried many times to try to find a way so that I can ground them and do the combo similar to the heavyweights. But in the end, I gave up and found a better way to just um, deal a lot of damage. So basically, it's the same thing um, as usual. You use Imp Doom, but instead of the second tap, you go with the third tap. Third tap. And then you quickly air launch. 
and then use George and George and finish with a bandwagon. So impending doom, one, two, three, air launch, George air, George box, and then bandwagon. Okay, let's try it in practice. So one, two, three, four, five, impending doom, one, two, three. And just like that. So your opponent gets hit with two special moves and two blockbusters all at once, and I think that's effective enough. Mm. Now we're gonna try and do it in practice. Mm. So I'll be using my sketchy here, and yes, I do have high level moves, but but um, to compensate, I'm using a 5k sketchy with 3k attack. So in the and in this um, node, your attack gets maxed to 5k anyway. Alright, so Peacock is a lightweight, so I can't ground her using the same combo I did with... Um, so what I'm gonna do here is just use my double bombs like that, just to get my meter up. And then now the impending doom is charged, I can 1, 2, 3, air juggle, air george, and bandwagon. Now I could have slot in boxcar george there, but it, it was still in cooldown, so I can't. And in here I can ground her, 1, 2, air juggle, air dash, and double bomb. Eliza is basically the same, she's quite heavy as well. But see, now that she's stunned, I could just spam my specials and blockbusters. So it's really, really flexible. And it, and it highly depends on whether your impending doom stuns them or not. Oh, this is dangerous. But anyway, that's just a quick showcase on what I learned using Peacock. Well, hope you guys found that useful on how to use Peacock, maybe just a bit on the gameplay. Um, of course, check out the other guys as well that submitted that gave me their advice they were really really good and i think they're much better at her than i am so thanks guys for watching and i hope to see you soon yeah.